Hey everybody, welcome back to Prepper Junkie. Today I'm going to go over some of the upgrades I've done for the CZ Brenz. Um, this is the 11 inch barrel and in the back there is the 16 and a half inch barrel. So let's dive on in and take a closer look. So um, this is the 16 and a half inch version, this is the 11 inch version. I've pretty much done the exact same upgrades. Um, this one with the, the pistol version, I am SBRing it. Um, I currently have this to put on, which is the Magpul ACR stock with the Dan Haga uh, mount. Uh, again, these are kind of hard to get a hold of right now too. You just everything in the gun industry when this when this video has been posted is kind of difficult to get in stock. Uh, I did join wait lists on the Dan Haga website and I can't remember where I got this, kinetic something. Anyway, um, so yeah, so this is gonna go on to this when the paperwork's approved. If you're looking to get the, the actual OEM stock, good luck. Uh, they're not commonly available in the US. Uh, a couple have popped up on Gunbroker, but they're selling for like 500 plus dollars and I was not willing to do that. Uh, I got the this one for about 275 and that was kind of pushing it for me. But I'm very happy, the quality is excellent. Um, you know, it's Magpul and Dan Hager. It's they're very nice. Anyway, all right, so let's move along here and, and go over the upgrades. Um, first of all, the Ambi safeties. I put in the HBI, let's see if I can go. I put in these HBI Ambi safeties. Uh, they're extended just a little bit and have these really nice ridges uh, on both sides. These are, again, the the parts that come with the Bren 2 are absolutely suffice. Um, I just like to put on the best stuff possible on my guns it's just how I am unfortunately um, and if you know especially if I feel like it is an upgrade I don't put stuff on just for the fun of it if I feel like it's a, an actual upgrade and it's going to benefit me then I put it on I should really said that at the start but anyway so yeah they have these really nice safeties here and they're very easy to put on yeah uh, they've just got these roll pins you knock out very simple uh, moving down to the trigger here I did put in their trigger it is um, it's see, their stock ones polymer and it's a nice enough trigger, um, but it has a, a little bit of over travel. Uh, and then with uh, with this, there's a little notch on the end here um, that actually, so when you pull the trigger, so you get a little bit of take up, pull the trigger, and that stops it right there. It, so there's no over travel on this. I mean, you're right at the wall. Um, so it's a nice upgrade. I'm very happy I did it also. And it's um, aluminum or, um, or some material like that. Again, very nice upgrade. Uh, one of the biggest upgrades I did um, for this was actually changing out uh, this part here. Uh, I'll roll in a, uh, a picture or something to show you the OEM one. Basically, it just sits back here. The, the gas um, settings are exposed, um, and it just doesn't look as clean, I think. Um, I just think it looks a lot cleaner, a lot nicer. Um, again, this wasn't very difficult to install. Um, there were several, um, quite a few screws, some in the bottom. Uh, on the sides, but again, it was it was pretty simple to do. And HBA Industry products, I'm absolutely in love with. They've been great to deal with. Ships fast. If it's out of stock, it's not out for stock for long. Um, high quality, high quality parts. So yeah, very impressed with them. Okay, so the next part um, I upgraded was this charging handle. Um, it's an extended, slightly extended charging handle out, um, and it has these really nice grooves. Let's see if I can get nice. You can see these grooves here uh, to give you a little more grip and, um, and it, it, so it's easier to get your finger on. I mean, again, the stock one is fine. It's just a little shorter. I just like this one is the extension. All right, well, that's pretty much it. Um, it was just a really quick uh, video. Again, I've done that with the 16 and a half inch. I'm really happy with these setups. I absolutely love the brands. Um, they've been phenomenal to shoot. Very, very, very happy with them. Um, so yeah, anyway, all right. If you have any questions, comments, please ask them below. Again, these parts, all the parts that I put on uh, aftermarket parts are from HBI Industries. Check them out if you have a brand too and you want to put some nice upgrades on your, on your guns. All right, that's it. Please like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I'll catch you guys the next time.